Guys, you know, we really like making connections on the show. Anytime we can. And we have a pretty big one yeah. right now. So we want to talk about, you know, we know there are thousands of people who only, whose only hope for survival is a marrow or like a stem cell transplant from a stranger. Mm -hmm. And the cool thing is you could have the power to cure someone's blood cancer, but maybe you don't know how. I know, we're always taught, you know, told that, but do we actually take the time to go and donate or give to whatever it is you need to give. So today we're going to be talking about something that's called Be The Match. And we want to introduce you to two amazing people whose lives now forever changed. It's Langley Hour from Linwood mm -hmm. and her donor all the way from <laughs> Germany. Can you believe it or not? That's where the donor was felt. This is Isabel Schmidt. And um, again, you two being partnered up is, is a, it, I mean, it literally is a miracle. It saved your life. We're going to talk about Be The Match a little bit later, but I want to talk to you about your story. Um, the moment you got diagnosed, when was that? It was January, January 2016. January 2016. And mm -hmm. the only way that you were told that you could survive is if you had someone who had your same type of DNA, yes. blood, or? DNA. DNA. Yes. And no one in your family? No one in my family was a match. They checked my sister and she was not a match. My kids were too young and my parents have their own health problem. So I was hopeless. And then um, they told me in June that they found a match. But, but before we get to June, in your letter that you wrote us, you were shopping for your, your burial site. Yes, I was um, very scared and sad and most time just crying, hopeless. And it's like my sister's not a match. And being minority, um, there's a um, limited donor on the registry. So I was very hopeless. So I went and shopped for my graveyard, yeah, my final so resting hard. place. <laughs> And we don't have to think about it anymore because it's we're all so emotional. It's, it's I know, emotional. I know. It's very emotional. It's and but. then for the for the person who is donating all the way from Germany, you have no idea. Yeah. I mean, you, you said you got into Be The Match because of your friend? Yeah, I had a friend uh, who was suffering from leukemia about 13 years ago, and that was the reason why I registered with the German uh, bone marrow organization. And then you got the call too, saying that we found a match for someone for with I you? I got a mail in April 2016 that I could potentially be a person, a, a match for someone. So, and I did some blood tests then, and then it was quiet for some time. And then in June, so two months later, uh, I got a call uh, if I would like to be donating because uh, I'm be like the, the most, um, or the, the match which is most. Likely uh, to succeed. Yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. Wow. Wow. So then, have you met each other before no. today? Yesterday. Yesterday. Yes. Yeah. Hold on. That How moment <laughs> must have been amazing. Yes. Hugging for like 10 minutes, probably. Yeah. Yes. Something like this. Yeah. <laughs> so I got to ask you, being someone who um, hasn't had you know health problems, and you're like, I would like to help someone else, and then now meeting the person you are helping, what is that like from your perspective? I mean, like, we had the chance to uh, have contact about two years uh, only writing letters through the organization, so we were not allowed to exchange data. Wait, and why is that? Is it just, I mean, why is that a rule? Do yeah. you know? Uh, imagine she would like getting sick again, okay. and because you build up an emotional connection already, uh, although you not, you not know the person uh, yet, right. but like imagine you would know the person and imagine you would not like the person. So that you would be like maybe thinking, oh no, I don't want to do it again. Mm. So they have like a, a blocking time of two years. So at least it's between the US and Germany. And after those two years, you can, um, you can have a personal contact if both parties agree to that. Makes sense, that makes sense. Is it easy to donate? Yes, it's very easy. So it's uh, actually what you do is uh, in 80% of the cases, they, you donate um, a per peripheral. So uh, it's just like it, they're taking blood, off, blood out of uh, the one arm right. and putting it on the other arm back. But before that, you start, when she's starting the chemotherapy, uh, the donor is starting uh, injections, so right. two times a day. Uh, so that your stem cells are getting into the blood system and so that at least in, in the end they filter your stem cells out of your blood system. So you're just lying there and uh, wait three, four, five hours and then... That's it? That's it. Wow. How has this changed both of your lives? Let's start with Langley. Um, you know, I try to treasure the time and day that I have. Mm -hmm. So I'm 
very happy to be here today and be with my kids as much time yeah. as I can if they allow me to. <laughs> of course. How much longer do you have until they say you're free to go? Are you still doing process of... I'm still taking medication okay. for the um, immune suppressant uh, medication mm -hmm. so that way uh, to suppress the immune system so it won't attack my organs because that's part of the, um, the risk of transplant is the new cell could attack my organs and it doesn't get along with my organs. It thinks it's a foreign object, so it starts to attack it. And, but now they're tapering it down, so that means good. it's good news. It's getting along quite well. So. Great. That's, That's amazing. Yes. I just can't believe that you guys have come together from all from across the world you know yeah, and yeah. that you have the same you have the majority of, you know like the yeah. dna match it's right. just yeah. incredible and so everybody knows like the story. there are more stories like this obviously but we're going to get down to like the nitty-gritty about specifics if anybody's curious and we'll chat with a representative from be the match you can text i mean we got that little thing on the bottom of the screen text the word match if you want any more information but thank you guys so much for your story we are hoping this inspires people to go mm -hmm. out and do it yeah. um, like she said, it, it's pretty, pretty easy.